Hey guys! Alright, so today I am going to bleach the knots on this wig. This is my Indian hair wig. Okay, this is a ready-to-go wig. Alright? So, of course, you know we got blonde me. And I'm going to take a scoop and put it in here. Can you see? Okay. Yeah, so, how are you all doing today? Hope you're having a good, good day today. So far, so good for me, too. I wasn't too busy, but, you know. Alright, so I'm just putting a little bit. If I need more, I'm just going to add more. I'm not going to start off with too much. Yeah, so today, I guess, I'm really thinking about, you know, connecting connecting with people. You know what I'm saying? People that I haven't connected with in a while. People that, you know, are just people that I need to stay in connection with. Just basically connect. Because it's very important to stay connected, especially during these times. You know, the older you get, the less amount of people you know. And you want to just make sure you stay, you know, connected. So I'm going to use this knife. All right. Reason why I use a knife is because that's just what I use. Okay. So pardon my ensemble. Alright. I'm gonna start off in the back. Alright, so I'm going very slowly. The hair that's, I guess that's going on there, is loose hair. I think I don't have enough, but we'll see. Because it's only a 4x4 four four closure. So, I shouldn't need like a whole bunch. But I'm not applying too much pressure, but just enough so it can go through. Because a lot of times, this is my... Um, Sometimes, you know, certain closures and lace, you, the knots are really, they're not big, but they're just strong knots. And then you can't, you know, you have to keep bleaching them, but we're just going to do this one time and done. And leave it on and keep checking it. Okay, I'm going to put some aluminum foil so it doesn't get dry. off my hands. Sorry about that. Sorry about that. Alright, so this is pretty quick because it's a 4 by 4 Did I say 4 by 4 You get what I'm saying. You get where I'm going. Getting it in the corner. And now the front. Which to me the front always bleaches a lot quicker. But we want to make sure the front is extremely, extremely covered. Completely. Because this is a thick, thick um, closure. So I need all my knots to be bleached. You heard? Yes. Oh, sorry. Man, period. <laughs> ah, but yes, no, seriously. Get this joint nice and nice and um, bleached. All right. 
Make sure you don't get anything. Well, I'm going to make sure I'm not trying to get anything on... The strands. All right. So as long as you got everything covered, you should be good to go. Let me make sure this side is covered too. All right, and I'm just looking right now to make sure that I got all the knots covered at the top. Okay. Just make sure when you do that, you wash it off. You don't want to put it on your head and it has bleach on it. Okay. If you get any, wipe it off. That looks like it's good to go. All right. So right now I'm putting aluminum foil on the lace that way it could trap the heat so you want to do that and you want to let it sit now for about um, 20 minutes check every another 10 minutes keep checking after 20 minutes every 10 minutes and let it sit until it gets to your desired length and then wash it out with some purple shampoo and tone it. Thanks for watching.